You know, often inside the big morning show, we'll get research. We get information about, you know, e- eating uh, quinoa will make your hair grow. Whatever, whatever it is. Like we get, work you need, out for you. You need to eat a little I haven't had it. I've never eaten quinoa. Can you tell? <laughs> yep. <laughs> so, so. <laughs> yes, almost, I actually have. I almost spilled my coffee. And it doesn't work. So, <laughs> so, but we, we see these studies and you'll get one study that says eating grapes is good for you. And then you'll see another study that says eating grapes will kill you today. Like, like, I don't understand. The government pays for all this research. Yeah. Didn't we have something this week that the, like the most dangerous thing to eat is lettuce? Yeah. 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 Lettuce. Might give you E. coli if you're not careful. Or you could just go have fun in Mexico and come <laughs> back with it. <laughs> <laughs> so, That's the story for another day. So if, <laughs> if, if you think it's bad when one day here we tell you, oh, no, it's great to have a glass of beer or it's it's bad to eat ground beef. And then the next day we seem contradictory. Well, it's not just us, right? This just in. A new study shows that a glass of red wine a day is good for your heart. We interrupt this program with an urgent message. Another study shows too much wine can cause your heart to explode. See? <laughs> Breaking news. Antioxidants in certain red wine can cure IBS and resting Karen face. Huh. But another study shows that the wine industry causes global warming and kills puppies. <laughs> with another study showing that drinking red wine can save an entire village of starving children. While yet another study shows that wine will disembowel you and leave you on the street bleeding in agony as onlookers do nothing to help but pull out their phones to videotape your gory demise to boost their social media likes. (laughs) It seems these studies cannot make up their mind. Join us tomorrow when we have a hundred new studies on the effects of coffee. That reminds me of the old, that's good, that's bad. No, that's good. No, that's that's. I'm so confused. I just want a glass of wine. Thanks for listening to the Big Morning Show with CJ Fast and Renee on Big 102.1.